Welcome to My Badge, I am Lieutenant Skip, and today we're gonna to talk about something that I think most people have felt, if not everyone, because everyone starts at this point where they're contemplating whether they want to get into law enforcement or not. Uh, it may be someone in the family has had a previous experience, they've seen it on TV, they've interacted with law enforcement, they've seen something firsthand and they felt that calling, which is phenomenal, you need that. But you need to dig deeper, you need to dive deeper and really see what you wanna do. If you take anything out of this video, take the point that you need to look and find a department that matches your personality. Okay? And what I mean by that is that generally in law enforcement within a state, you're gonna have a uh, smaller city department, you may have a mid to large city police department, you're gonna have the county sheriff's department, and you're gonna have a state patrol or a highway patrol. Okay? And each one of those types of departments will require a different type of policing. A lot of times the highway patrols are very traffic oriented. They have jurisdiction in the entire state and they're gonna be doing a lot of the highway enforcement. Counties are gonna be within those counties, the unincorporated space between cities. They also run the jails, so you may have the potential of starting off in the jails. Make sure you're comfortable or at least aware of that possibility. They run the courthouses, do the courthouse security. They have patrol functions and they are also responsible for disaster management within a state. So we're talking about floods, fires, emergency evacuations, earthquakes. The county is generally and typically responsible for that. Then we can look at police departments. You can have a smaller city police department and that's going to give you a lot of opportunity to have that uh, community policing atmosphere where you're going to know people, you're going to see them daily and you can move on to the mid and large size departments where there's going to be a lot more people. You may not see the same people every day but you're still going to have that route of community policing and trying to address things on a larger scale. Mid-sized, larger size apartments are going to be a little bit busier, have a little bit more crime, just based on population density. So that's if that's something that you're looking at that you want, you need to look at that. But if it's not, be aware of it. All right. So that's what I mean by making sure that the department that you're looking at meets your personality. It's going to be really important because you do not want to go into an agency where you're just not feeling fulfilled. You're feeling frustrated because you're not doing what you want to do. And that's not good for you, not good for the department. And you've heard me harp about this in my other videos, and I'm going to say it again. You need to go on a ride along. Okay. The reason I say this is that will give you that opportunity to see if this is for you, if this type of policing is for you, and you can make an educated decision moving forward. And that is going to be important. Okay. Um, if you haven't taken a look at on, uh, on our website already, we have a phenomenal ride along program where we break down some of the the structure of a police department, so that way you are not walking in blind. And we're gonna talk about you know, the responsibilities, anywhere all the way from the commander, the captain, the lieutenant, the sergeant, to the officer. So you have some framework when you go on that ride along, so you're not feeling uh, overwhelmed or lost and not being able to follow what's going on. But the reason I mention this is that it will give you that ability to draw on stories, understand what's going on, and then help you picture whether you can see yourself in this career, doing what those officers next to you are doing. And that's going to be essential. That is the first thing that you need to do before you start applying to different departments. Find out what you want to do, narrow your window down, and start applying to those specific departments. If you have any questions, feel free to hit me up at Earn My Badge. And if not, have a great day.